But by local NJ, we quickly realize how important lighting is when making video. Today, we're here in Union, New Jersey at Pulse Stage Lighting. Today we're here with the founder and president of Pulse Stage Lighting, Scott. Scott, thanks for welcoming us to your warehouse here. Well, it's, it's, uh, it's, it's a privilege to have you guys here. It's awesome. It's awesome. I've never had uh, been on this side of the light, so it's a little different for me. Well, thanks for setting up these lights. <laughs> I understand that you started your business back in 1990. Can you tell us how you got started? Um, Actually, yeah, it was really funny. It was a, it was kind of a goof. Uh, I was working for the Lions VA Medical Center, and one of my friend's bands, he said, uh, you know, we need lights. And I said, oh, I used to do lights. And he said, well, we have a couple lights, and here's three lights and a switch controller. And, you know, why don't you come out and do lights for us? So I did. And um, they called themselves Impulse. So I was like, ah, as a goof. And my brother on his Apple II GS made, a, made this card and I said, we're gonna call it pulse band lighting. And then some years, about two or three years later, I said, you know, pulse band lighting seems a little narrow. And I was starting to like it because I was doing it in high school. So it was kind of like one of those, those things that, that, that kind of became a, a evolved over the, over the years. And um, so I changed it to pulse stage lighting and um, I started pursuing that a little bit more because as a carpenter, I was in and out of, you know, like the, the, the trends were changing, uh, the VA had a layoff and I was working all over the place. So uh, I was starting to find my passion more in, in lighting. So I, 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 I pursued it as much as I possibly could. And then one day opportunity came and, uh, you know, I just, I went full time with it. I went full time with it in 1995. Yeah, 1995 was, was when I became doing business as Pulse Stage Lighting. I imagine in 25, almost 30 years, the business must change quite a bit. What kind of customers are you serving today? Oh God, I have so many customers. We do pretty much everything. I mean, literally everything. I do weddings, I do bar mitzvahs, I do concerts, I do corporate events, I do product launches. I mean, we just did Hasbro. Um, we did Hasbro, we did the new, a new product launch for them. We, we, were, uh, we toured with uh, Novartis Pharmaceutical for years, um, and there was a lot, of, a lot of changes in the way they did, the way they, their, their salespeople were. We had, um, we did, uh, we got Sony coming up, uh, we do fashion. Um, I just got done doing Zimmerman, uh, which is a big one. We used to do Nar Narciso Rodriguez, who he decided he stopped doing fashion. I've done lights for Neil Diamond. I've done big concerts in in uh, like Rock Carnival in Clark. We did uh, Rock Carnival down in in Lakewood. Uh, Oh, I even did a guy's backyard party not too long ago, a couple a uh, couple months ago. We we really we really are try to be very diversified from what we do with lighting, staging, video, rigging. I mean, I also work with WWE. I've been with WWE for ten years. I've been with SIR Studios, which is Studio Instrument Rentals out of New York. I've been with them for like sixteen years. Um, I have uh, I have a lot of clients. I also do. Uh, uh, I've been with the same client since 1997 doing her dance company. I mean, I have longevity with a lot of my clients. Yeah, it sounds like from s a small backyard party to something like WWE, which is a big production. For somebody who is having a private event, whether it's a wedding or a corporate event, what sort of things should they be looking for in their service provider? I guess cost effectiveness is really, you know, what are you getting for your money? Because, you know, today, any, any person can run out and, and buy gear at uh, Sam Ash or, or, you know, some of the bigger stores, the box stores. But you also get what you pay for at those box stores. You don't get service. You don't get the quality. When you go to those people that went to those box stores, they are not as uh, knowledgeable as of their products a lot of times because the salesman isn't knowledgeable enough to teach them about their products. And that's why you want to come to somebody that has some, some longevity and some, some stamina in the, in the industry. And that's where we come to play because 
we've been around for a long time. We started from the ground up, and I mean from the ground up with literally three lights and a little switch controller. And I worked, I worked from there to a pickup truck with a, with a trailer. I was doing, I did uh, the Goo Goo Dolls with a trailer and a small amount of lights. You know, um, we, we've been everywhere from Boston to Louisiana to Texas to Las Vegas. I mean, and I can just say that that experience is where, what you're looking for when you, when you do that kind of stuff because without that experience, you're gonna pay more in the end. You guys are pretty full service, right? You provide the equipment, but you're also uh, providing a professional or a team of professionals we're, to we're, support. We're design. We, we go from concept to design to implementation. So you can come up, with a, come up to us and say, this is what my idea is. And I take it and I turn it into what it is. We did the Tom Clancy uh, release of a uh, video game, okay? My client showed up and said, look, I want, I want it to look like steam coming out from the ground. I want the, the police car to look like it's got snow on it. I, I want this, I want that. We took his, his drawings his, and we turned them into, a, into reality. And uh, that's, that's kind of what we do. That's really cool. I guess sometimes it's, sometimes what you're doing is behind the scenes and not noticeable as being part of the event. Hopefully you don't want, right? You don't want the lights to be the focus, but other times probably it is that it's adding a lot of effect and mood. Well, isn't that, that's really what concerts do. I mean, like, you know, and again, I think the, the concert situation is, is where your, my creativity is. And so, like you said, that's the, the concert is part of that. You want that effect. You want that lighting, that look, and that changes the moods and, ac and, and accents the songs, so to speak. Um, and then, of course, you get into a wedding. And, you know, you're setting the tone for the wedding, whether it's, you know, what their, what their color schemes are, what their, you know, how they envision this room to look. You know, we walk into a blank space sometimes and turn it into... Um, what it is. You know, I also work with designers that, you know, will come in with fabric and they'll come in with, with floral arrangements. And we, we work with them as well on, on those projects to also help enhance whatever the, whatever the direction of the client is. As a New Jersey-based business here in Union, how do you support the local community? We do a lot of, a lot of uh, fundraising in Baskin Ridge, Bernardsville. That's where I, that's where I'm from, you know. So uh, I still go back to where I'm from and I go and do community service out there um, with uh, the Chamber of Commerce. As you know, I'm vice president of the Chamber of Commerce and I'm very proud that we have uh, grown over the many years of being in the Chamber of Commerce and the Chamber of Commerce has grown with us as well. You know, and they've helped us out and we've helped them out. That's pretty much how I give back. I give back through charitable, charitable events, PBA, uh, PBA stuff locally, um, stuff like that, Long Hill Township. That's great. And what's your website? It is uh, www.pulsestagelighting.com and been in business for a long time. Fantastic. And uh, Yeah. Well, thank you for joining us today. Uh, we appreciate you and if you like this video, please like it, hit subscribe, leave a comment below, and thank you for buying local to help to support and build local communities. Thank, thank you. Thank you so much. Hi, I'm Al Licata, president of the Berners Township Regional Chamber of Commerce. We'd like to thank you for watching this episode of Buy Local NJ. We're glad to be partnering with Runnymede Capital Management and Buy Local NJ to bring our chamber members to you, the consumer, to learn about the greater goods and services in your area for both your home and business use. Speaking of business, if you own a business, whether you're a home-based business or a Fortune 500 company, consider joining our growing chamber membership. Call us at area code 908-766-6755 and learn about all the great ways we can help you get exposure for your business and cut the cost of doing business. Once again, thank you for watching this great episode. We look forward to bringing you more of our chamber members throughout the calendar year. And we look forward to seeing you buying local, New Jersey.